Hello Hunters and welcome to the channel. I have been asked a few times about my in-game settings, so I thought I'd put something together so I can refer to it in the future, but also I would like to talk about ways to improve your game and possibly aim. I'm not the greatest aimer, nor am I close, but I have enjoyed FPS games on the PC since 1999. Yes, I'm getting old, but I have a few tips to help improve game performance and also your performance. I have included timestamps so you can jump to whatever interests you. Firstly, let's go over my in-game settings. Control scheme, Gunslinger. I'm used to traditional FPS games where I right click and aim. Having an additional button in this process hurts my brain and my aim. There was an advantage to having the hunter control scheme because you couldn't lower your gun, which meant hunters could see your weapon poking through walls and floors. However, now you combine the key to put your weapon in a lowered state. So unless hunt is your only game, I would recommend changing this if you haven't already. My field of view is 106. I have used this FOV for as long as I can remember. It's the sweet spot for me. I have both lowered and shoulder aim, FOV set to default. Having a FOV that changes depending on the state of your weapon could be useful, but for me, I like to keep things simple. ADS is set to hold, crouch is toggle, and sprint is hold. Sensitivity. I use different sensitivities depending on the game. In hunt, I have a rather slow sensitivity, which helps my flick style of aiming. Default and shoulder is 0.61 which is a 43cm 360. This can change, depending on how I'm getting on that day. I do sometimes change to a 35cm 360, which would be a 0.76 in-game. My ADS doesn't change at 0.33. I don't use a lot of scopes, but here are those settings. If you are unsure of your settings or want to convert them from game to game, I use a website called mousesensitivity.com. Simply add your game, sensitivity and DPI, and then select the game you want to convert to. Scroll down and you'll see the settings you need, it also shows your centimeter 360. Graphics. I play on full screen. Render resolution is set to 100. I have 1.10 on gamma which helps lighten up the inside of buildings. My VRAM is 80%. I suggest you play with yours, as this setting can cause stutters. 80% simply works best for me. Object quality. Low. This changes the rendering distance of objects, grass and bushes, which can help with spotting enemy hunters at distance. Everything else is maxed out except for effect quality. V-Sync, off. Depth of field, off. Motion blur, off. Please don't have this on. Advanced settings, all on except for surface format optimization. Honestly, I don't see any difference in image quality or frames with these on or off, but you might, so double check. Let's talk about aim, which is subjective. There are so many different mice, mouse pads, mouse grips, sensitivities. What's right for you? Honestly, I can't tell you. I own about 50 mice and even more mouse pads. But what I can tell you is comfort is key. This is also something the top aimer in the world has stated. He's called VT Matty. He recently won a Red Bull Ready Check aim competition where the likes of It's Timmy, one of the top Apex aimers, was also competing. Link to the finals in the description. But what does comfort mean? For me, it means find a mouse that you can grip naturally. Do not force your fingers into positions they don't want to be in. This will obviously be better for your health in the long run. So you have a natural grip, a great mouse, great mouse pad. What now? Practice. No matter what it is you want to achieve, you need to practice. I personally spend about 10 to 15 minutes before jumping into my first game in the firing range in both Hunt and any other game. In Hunt, I practice flicking onto the dummies' heads with different weapons. You can also get a feel for bullet travel with the dummies that are further away. Put your favourite playlist on, relax and shoot for about 15 minutes. I guarantee you will have a better game session because of it. Thank you for watching.